Hey guys, and welcome to this quick tutorial on Master Pose Component. So what we're going to do is we're going to take this piece of armor and we're going to change it from being static uh, skeletal mesh into a piece of armor that actually attaches to our dude and follows his animations. So what we're going to do is we're going to go into our guy and we're going to add a skeletal mesh and we're going to connect it to our guy and we'll just make it, we're just going to zero it out by clicking all these and then we're going to select, it's one of the attached ones here, attach male uh, 3, we'll just do that one. And as you can see by default it's stationary and it doesn't copy his animation, it just stays there and looks kind of bad. So what we're going to do is, well first I'm going to change it to a different material just so it's easier to see. And then we're going to go into our event graph and we're going to right click, begin play. And then off this we're going to do set master pose component and we can do um, Skeletal mesh as the target, because the target should be the uh, the armor, and the mesh is our character in this case, and set him to the master bone component, and that's literally all we need to do. It's so simple. So now we just go in, we hit play, and as you can see, his armor follows his animation. So that's how you can do a simple attach uh, armor and set master pose component. So you can use this for clothing or for attachments or armor or whatever you'd like. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.